All right, today we're gonna show you really quickly how to make our gorgeous gooey gobstopper experiment. This only takes a just very little amount of time to set up and within a couple minutes you'll start seeing uh, kind of the effect we're going for. All right, now I'm gonna open the gobstoppers. You kind of do this however you want. You can make a single line around the edge of the plate. I like adding a lot of them. Do your best to kind of get them spread around. And then, the last part, we're just going to add some water. We can actually speed this up a little bit. This is just regular water. Make sure it covers the whole bottom of our plate. We don't want our candy moving around too much. And now, we watch. All right, so that was a little time lapse of our gorgeous gooey gobstopper experiment. And now for fun, I brought in this little fan here. I'm just gonna turn it on. I don't know if it's gonna do anything, but kinda cool. I had to see if it blow it around in a circle, maybe. Right Kind of cool. Just kind of blows it all together into a color. But... Alright, and that is our experiment. All you need is a plate, a box of gobstoppers, and some water. After what we just saw, I wouldn't even bother with the fan. It didn't do a whole lot. So, have fun. Enjoy making your gorgeous, gooey gobstoppers.